hello welcome back to my new video my new video is related to the repeater mode okay in this mode uh, we have uh, one main router with the internet connection okay and we want to have uh, a wireless uh, signals in our non-reachable area maybe our first floor or maybe some open garden at our home so we need another access point uh, which uh, we have to be which we need to be configured in the repeater mode okay so as i mentioned here in definition in repeater mode your router wirelessly connects to an existing wireless network to extend the wireless coverage in this mode the firewall ip sharing and net function is disabled because this function is uh, uh, is processed by this uh, main router mean router mode the one which having the internet connection okay so i'm using d-link uh, router access point with me the wi-fi router and i'm going to configure it as a repeater mode and i will show you how to apply the configuration okay so uh, let me show you my uh, network adapter settings Uh, as you can see my PC LAN is uh, having the IP address of 192.168.0.100 in my case and the wireless router default IP address is 192.168.0.1 in the D-Link if you are using some other vendor you can find the details on the back side of the sticker of the device there will be a sticker pasted on it and you can find the main uh, default ip settings there if not you are unable to access it via the default there is a hard reset button you can reset the device to factory default 0 0.1 as you can see i can ping my router so let's apply the configuration start i'm going to choose the english language yes and continue and i am going to use the connection method as wi-fi and I'm going to use the method as repeater okay as you can see that uh, we have one uh, access point and we have another access point and we want to connect it over the wireless okay next uh, I'm going to change the IP address of the new router which is working uh, we want to work it as a repeater so we have to change the IP address because uh, it will create a conflict because 0 0.1 is the main router and 0 0.2 is the repeater next and uh, we have to join the existing uh, the new router to the existing main router so in my case uh, I have a main router already configured this one and I will uh, paste the link for the configuration video of the same uh, uh, of the configuration in the video description in case uh, if you need uh, to if you want to verify it or if you want to watch you can just watch by clicking on the link okay so in my case uh, my main router is acting as a router mode 2.4 this is my main router as per my video you can see here router mode so i give the same name in ssid to understand it more easily so abc 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 okay as you can see this is my wi-fi password for the main router okay this is my main router uh, wi-fi password okay so click next and uh, as you can see for the repeater uh, i will i will find the new extended ssid if i show you here as you can see this is router mode this is showing only router mode but there is no router extended here as you can see here okay so once we finish the configuration we will find the new repeater with the extended uh, address or either we can say we can change the mode to repeater or epea repeater mode extended okay and uh, i will click on next and i will just make it as uh, repeater mode extended for 5 gigahertz frequency and this is my password next and this is my local management okay next as you can see the LAN is uh, 0.2 this is my main router IP address 
and when we discover after the configuration when we run a discovery of the wireless we will see the SSID as a repeater mode extended and repeater mode extended 5G and uh, mode will be repeater mode of the new router okay so let's apply okay to apply the configuration it will take little bit of while okay Now let's log into our new router 0 0.2. Okay. I'll just cancel. Let me show you my main router configuration 1, 2, 3. Okay. Uh, as you can see, this is my main router which is working as a uh, router mode as per my PPT and I will show you my second router okay as in a repeater mode okay 0 0.2 okay admin admin 1 2 3 4 login okay as you can see it is showing 5 gigahertz with SSID as a repeater and this is SSID as a repeater okay under the statistics as you can see client session I have a PC which is directly connected with 0 0.100 on the LAN interface and under the port statistic you can see I have only one LAN connection now if you come to Wi-Fi if you come to additional uh, sorry client as you can see the connection information it is connected connected to with the main SSID which is router mode okay so this new router which is acting as uh, the IP address is 0 0.2 okay it is connected to main router router mode 2.4 okay as you can see here it is connected wirelessly I don't have any wire connection so let me show you the wireless verification I have this uh, second Wi-Fi card this is my main router router mode 2.4 I should uh, we will find this new router extended as you can see repeater mode extended this is our uh, extended repeater mode device I will connect to this and I will just uh, apply the password ABC 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 this is the one we assigned during the configuration and I will just click on next it is now connected okay let's uh, let's ping google 8.8.8 .8 as you can see I can ping google and let's browse something on internet like google.com I can browse google yahoo yahoo.com okay okay guys uh, this is the that's it for right now so our repeater mode is uh, healthy and it is working fine and as you can see my second uh, network Wi-Fi card is uh, connected to the repeater mode uh, SSID okay to the second router and if I show you the details of uh, client uh, I will show you the statistics client and session uh, as you can see I have uh, this MAC address which is connected to wireless LAN interface okay
as you can see here is repeater mode extended and I have internet access here okay this is my second Wi-Fi card but it's not connected and this is my PC if I disable this as you can see it's still it I am having internet access and I will show you the browsing again I'll just close this and I will apply google.com as you can see I can still have internet using the repeater mode access point okay so mean over uh, configuration is perfectly fine everything is okay if you have uh, any question please kindly comment uh, in the video and uh, don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel thank you for watching my videos take care bye bye